Hi, I'm Michelle, and today we'll be discussing the methods that you can use to form your LLC in New York. We're going to be covering the steps involved in starting your LLC, the form that you're going to need, the name and requirements, and the six main steps needed to actually register your LLC. I'll also be explaining the importance of having a registered agent and a very key term known as piercing the corporate will. Now, if these terms aren't familiar to you, then I highly recommend you watch this video. To start LLC in New York, business owners need to get different permits such as building permits, health permits, or if it's a restaurant, then you need food-related businesses permits. Businesses thriving in New York are financial services and the manufacturing industry. General software, mobile devices, they cover the manufacturing industry's biggest chunk as well as closed manufacturing. You can start your New York LLC by three methods. Number one, you can do it yourself. Or number two is that you hire the professional service to do it for you, which is the most easy and secure method out there. We personally recommend Zen Business as one of the best and most affordable services for this purpose. Number three is that you can go ahead and hire an attorney. Now coming to a very common question, but a very important question. What exactly is an LLC? Well, an LLC is a hybrid business entity combining a corporation's characteristics with a partnership or sole proprietorship. It separates your personal assets from your business assets and helps protect your personal assets. Now, when you're starting an LLC in New York, you mainly have to file your certificate of formation with the state and pay a filing fee of $200. With Zen Business, you can start off your LLC with just $0, but you do have to pay the mandatory state fees. With Zen Business, you get three plans, your starter plan, your pro plan, and your premium plan. It is perhaps the only formation service company that offers three important features in all of its plans. The starter plan has all the essential services required to form an LLC, and it is a very suitable plan for you if you want a budget-friendly LLC formation plan. The starter plan is available at $0. However, you do have to pay the mandatory state filing fees. It's very cost effective and it offers all your essential services like your registered agent and operating agreement draft. The pro plan offers some essential additional services along with the main services which are being offered in the starter plan. Also, in the pro plan, it takes lesser time to form your LLC. In this plan, what are you getting? You're getting an advertising consultant, you're getting animal compliance services, and an expedited filing process. The premium plan is pretty much the costliest plan offered by Zen Business. The premium plan offers almost all the services related to the formation of an LLC. In addition to the services mentioned in the first two plans, which was the starter plan and the pro plan, it offers a faster filing process, business website, domain, and email address. In this video, we're going to be discussing options number one and number two, but we're going to place emphasis on why you need a professional service to do it for you, because you have to make sure that you're doing your LC work correctly, because this is one of those things where you can't afford missing any key information or have any form of misunderstandings. Zen Business is a very competent professional service that you can get, because forming an LC is not just filing the certificate of formation, but it's also deciding on a name, hiring a registered agent, creating an operating agreement, and obtaining an EIN. Now, all of these can be done super easily with Zen Business. I'll be leaving the links in the description below so you can easily go there and check them out. Now we're going to go and discuss in detail the six important steps that you must cover when you're forming your LC in New York. Now, the first step to starting off your LLC in New York is basically choosing the business name. Now, before you name your business, you must know that the name should be easy to remember, available in the state, and follows the LLC naming guidelines. You can find the naming guidelines at lcbuddy.com. The four key things that you need to be aware of when you're starting to name your LLC is that number one, your business name should be available and no other existing business in New York can have that name. Number two is that limited liability company or LLC should be there as a suffix in the company name. Number three is that you cannot use any name for your business that could be confusing or misleading. Terms such as Treasury, State Department, FBI, CIA, they cannot be included. Number four is that terms like bank, attorney, university, doctor, they can be added, but only after you fill out the additional requirements by the New York State government. If you do not wish to file your LLC right now, but you kind of want to hold on to the name you have decided, then you can reserve your name for up to 60 days. Now, to keep the name, you have to file a name reservation application and pay $20 to reserve the name. 
coming to the second and the most highly vital step to forming an LLC is to appoint a registered agent. A registered agent is an entity that's going to be acting and working on your LLC's behalf and is going to be receiving all the important paperwork and other official government correspondence within New York. This is why you need a very competent registered agent. You need to make sure that your agent is a resident of New York or at least has a physical street address there. The business address is used as the LLC's principal address within New York. Now, most LLC formation companies also do provide registered agent services. Zen Business provides registered agent services as an add-on to their formation package or as a standalone service. Now, a key thing to know with getting a registered agent is the importance of having one and having a legit one. Because in a case of lawsuit or if you're getting sued, the lawyer of the other party is going to do what is known as piercing the corporate will. Now, most people believe that they're setting up their LLCs for tax purposes, but the real reason for setting up your LLC is to limit your liability. Basically, what it does is that it creates a divide between your personal assets and your business assets. So if you're sued in your business, they can't go after your personal assets. And when you're sued, the attorney or the one going to be suing you is going to start looking for cracks in your LLC. And this is where they pierce a corporate will. The first thing they're going to check is, do you have a registered agent? Is the agent legit? And have they been filing the paperwork correctly? The third and another important step in forming an LLC is to file a certificate of formation. This is a legal document needed to officially register your business with the Secretary of State. It's going to cost you $200 to file your formation certificate in New York. The certificate of formation includes your details like the name of your LLC, registered agent's name, address, employee details, structure of your company, are you member managed, are you manager managed. So before you start hiring employees in New York, you should really know about the rules and regulations thoroughly to avoid any future issues. We personally suggest that you use Zen Business to file the certificate of formation because they provide a very easy way to fill out the forms without any confusion or missing any step. If you happen to get stuck anywhere, they have great customer support where you can go ask your questions and they will respond to you. Step number four is that you need to meet New York LLC publication requirements. Every LLC in the state of New York needs to publish a notice in two separate newspapers, one daily and one weekly, within 120 days of the formation. These are some of New York's publication requirements which every LLC must follow. This notice of publication should be published for six weeks continuously. LLCs cannot choose any newspapers. The papers must be approved by the local county clerk of the county where your LLC is located. After the publication, LLCs will receive one affidavit of publication from each publisher. Now, to file the certificate of publication, LLCs need to submit the certificate of publication form along with the affidavits of publication which they receive from their publishers. Now coming on to the operating agreement. An operating agreement is an internal document that legally outlines the proprietorship and operating procedures of your LLC. This document is vital as it ensures that all the business owners are on the same page regarding how they operate, their business resolution, voting power, and a lot more. Now this helps reduce future conflicts. So when it comes to filing your New York LLC operating agreement, the state does require you to have a very comprehensive operating agreement. And it is ideal to have one that contains the details of your entire business operation and leave nothing out. It's recommended that it should be done by using a professional service such as Zen Business, since they know exactly what to do and you won't have to worry about missing out any of the details. The EIN, which is also known as the Employer Identification Number, is a nine-digit number given by the IRS to make it much easier to identify the types of businesses for tax purposes and taxes in general. The EIN is necessary for any active business or any form of business for that matter. An EIN is needed when the LLC hires employees. Now, how do you get an EIN? All you have to do is fill up a form, which can be done online, or you can do it by mail and just submit it to the IRS. You can also get the EIN through Zen Business and they can help you out with the process. I'm going to be leaving the links to all the resources in the description below. You can go there, you can check out which of the options fit your requirements. But for now, I'm going to be showing you how you can file the forms using Zen Business. Now, this is the main page for Zen Business. You can type up your business name and you can have a search over there and you can start off your LLC. Now you can see right here that they have more of a chatbot system going on, not just plain filling out the forms. It's pretty interactive if you think about it. Pick out the state you want to start your business in. Now they're going to run a name check, see if it's available or not in the first place. Just enter your name here. They really just want to talk to you. That's why it's going to require your name over there. 
Do you have any prior business experience? Let them know if you're going to have any employees as well. Let them know if you want to have any physical location other than your home. So like if you're setting up a shop or you're going to be operating from home. Let them know what stage of business you're at. Let them know what your goals are. Is it a side business, primary income, or is it something new completely? Pick a category. Check if you want to save your progress or not. This one is going to take a bit of a time because they're just like calculating stuff, checking if their name is available or not, any pre prerequisites that they might require. Now, they're even recommending you get a registered agent and I really recommend you do. Do you need an EIN and business documents? Like I said in the video, you really should go through that rather than going to the IRS website and possibly making any mistake that could cost you your filing entirely. This is where they're going to tell you all of their packages. They have the starter plan, the pro plan and the premium plan. This is going to break it down for you. The pro plan is going to cost you $199 per year. It has its advantages. You can go through the full package detail as well. Zen Business Money Pro is an added feature which helps you manage your money on finances all in one place. Check if you want to get the expedited or rush filing. If you're in a hurry, you can go for it. If you're not and you can wait a couple of days, I recommend you do that. They also offer online tools like your custom website, domain name, privacy, email address. So if you're looking for that, you can add that on as well. Check if you want a customized operating agreement. Like I said earlier, it's better if you have one. Select if you want annual worry fee compliance. It's really up to you. It's basically them handling your annual taxes. Fill out your information here that they require name and suffix, whatever they need, email and number. Review your order, see if you have anything you want to check or if you want to include anything or take away anything. And then you can just continue to payment and that's all you need to set up your LLC with Zen Business. Now that you've created your New York LLC, there are still few things you might be missing out. You need a company business bank account and a business credit card. You need to file the New York business permits and licenses. You need to get general liability insurance and professional liability insurance, which is going to cover your employees. You need to file the New York annual report. However, they also require a biennial report that must be filed every two years. The biennial report contains mostly basic technical information about the LLC. I really hope this detailed video helped you out on how to start off your LLC in New York. And I wish you the best of luck if you're starting off your business there. Please continue supporting our channel by liking the video, subscribing to our channel and clicking the notification button. Thank you for watching.